welcome to buildingblocks.tv i'm christopher well um, today's tip is the five p's prior planning prevents poor performance what does that mean the shift didn't go the way you like staff didn't do what you wanted them to mistakes happen at the door food didn't come, you know if something didn't happen and it keeps then mm -hmm. it's about prevention it's about preventing that and preparing so you weren't prepared properly one way to prepare properly is to do a pre-shift meeting with your staff so three four minute meeting with all your service staff could be your kitchen also if you want but right before service so five minutes ten minutes before the first customer walks in the door you want to have that meeting ideally three things you want to touch in there a positive news a good news uh, we have an important guest that's coming in uh, some result that you know something that you guys were working last month well this is how we did a customer come you know comment that was fantastic about a certain server about you about the food about whatever a positive news about the place okay get some happy to work there and proud so come with a positive idea or positive news something about the food a new item something that's missing if something is not available well, especially if you have a special something that's new whatever it is something about the menu the food a new drink that's coming out or a new drink that you're trying out a new wine that you have a new wine by the glass whatever it is something about an item in the restaurant and third but not you least, want to come up with something you want the whole team to work on okay not a bitching session not a complaining session not a finger pointing session something let's clean as we go guys so when the guest is leaving and they're paying the bill there should be only you know coffee cups or gla water glasses left on the table as you go clean the table make sure that it's cleaned up you want to make sure people are conscious of the door and if you don't have you know a hostess well everybody needs to greet the door within 15 seconds if you're passing by you see somebody coming in it's your responsibility to greet then you reinforce that especially the first hour of the shift somebody does it tap on the back thank you guys you know thank you for doing that you did that great somebody's not doing it guys remember what we talked about about. I need you to be conscious of that and react when somebody shows up at the door. Good job, you did that. Boom, reinforce talk, ask questions. What did we say was the new drink today? What's in it? What's the item that's missing? Um, you know, ask questions, especially as the shift starts and everybody's getting into motion before they fall into their rut and just do their whole thing. So three things, a good news, something about a new item, whether it's you know from the bar or the kitchen, and something that you want them to work on. A positive thing, upbeat, you want them to get out of there proud, happy, ready to work. You don't want to make a bit, like I said, a bitching session. Make it happy, make him go out of there, ready to jump on the floor and, you know, bring in money for them, for the business and make clients happy before they get out the door. Thank you very much. If you have any comments, write them down here on the blog or you can write me at info at rbvsolutions.com. I would gladly uh, talk to you or answer your questions. Talk to you soon. Have a great day. Good success.